Breaking news, Nigerians. Finally, finally, Nigerian government has been exposed. So this is the reason why they'll be keeping the IPOP leader in detention. Even when they know that they have no case against him. My people, Aso Rok Sheko, as Binta Inyako, under fire. She panics over leaked audio with Shetima, the vice president of Nigeria, planning how to jail Kano. So you see, Binta Inyako knows what is happening, and she knows what the Nigerian government is up to, and the reason why she is trying to run away from this case. But as it is right now, the case don't ready who come for truth. Do you know why I will not pity for her? In the first place, she was compromised. You understand? Playing the script when she knows the truth. As a judge, you know the truth. You understand? If two persons, you know, judge matter to you, as a judge, as a lawyer, even when they never finish, you go must at least identify that this is not this. This is how this is supposed to be. So right from the beginning of this case, since 2017, you understand? Binta Inyako knows the truth that the Nigerian government don't overdo. You get? They don't temper Mazen and the Kanu's human rights, which Nigerian constitution is even against. The reason why he was acquitted, he was discharged, but uh, not as uh, then led by Muhammad Buhari, President Muhammad Buhari said, no, they are not done with uh, Namdi Kano. The former AGF, Abubakar Malami, used night, turn day, you know, manipulate everything and uh, make sure that Mazen Namdi Kano never left the DSS custody. So you see, now, the question now is, if you are, if you have already you know and uh, know what you want to do or if you have already made up your mind of what to do so why are you still delaying you know why they are delaying they are scared to pronounce it they are scared to say it because they know they have no case against him as uh, sami made said uh, the other time and uh, i think a day after being tainyako formally withdraw first from the case. He said, there was a time he met with Binta Inyako. He said, you see this Mazen Namdekano's case. The government have no case against him. This is the same person. He said they don't have any proof against Mazen Namdekano. So they are just flying around the matter. You get? They are just flying around the matter because they know they have no case against the IPOB leader. So come on. Someone you know to where you have no case against him. And you, you are still planning to jail him. So you now see the reason why the Igbos are saying they hate them so much. The hatred is just too special to them. I don't know how to put it. I just want you to understand how heavy the hatred against the Igbo is. They said the Biafra war has ended. Now the question is, has it actually ended? Have we forgotten what happened? Because it seems that it, it, it seems that we are still dwelling in the past. Then, if you don't want these people close to you, why can't just why can't you just give them their freedom? Why can't you just let them go? You know, fit stand their presence. You know, fit stand. You know, why can't you just let them go? You see this case. You see this case. Is a, a test to the new Nigerian CJN, Justice Kudirat Kekiri. You understand? Some people are saying, ah, she's a nice woman. She is somebody who stands for the truth. This Mazen Abdikanu's case is a test. Yes. It's just a pity that what happened in Nigeria is continuously, as it, is it cont you, you go carry your file as they come out. You go carry your file, give the person when they come. You see, as they do this matter, that is how you are going to continue. And this is not helping Nigeria. See, the way Nigeria is being uh, treated now before the uh, international community. They said we are giants of Africa. 
But today, we are being looked down by other countries. We are being looked down by other countries because we don't do things right. We don't do things right. We even go against our constitutions. We get rules and regulations that guide us, but we don't obey. We don't go, we don't go according to how it is. If we know that it's not going to favor the government, they know it's not going to favor them, they change it. That is how they're changing. They are now changing the law anyhow as they like. This is really, really too bad. It's not a good name. It's not a good thing. You understand? This is not a good thing at all. Well, right now that the secret has been exposed, let's see how they will manage to escape from this. Yes. Let's see how they will manage to escape from this. Well, I'm dropping it here, guys. Kindly drop your comments below the comment section. Don't forget to give us a thumbs up. Share this video. Let it go viral. Let Nigerians understand what is happening today in the Nigerian political landscape. Thank you and bye for now.